task 11 Q wants you to put in four formulae in the report at the bottom of the report and this one that you're looking at is one of them or the first one if you know how to do this one then you can copy this formula and do some minor changes and then you can put the rest underneath now how are we going to do it and obviously we cannot do uh, put in the test or the formula here because we are in the report view we should go to the design view to put in the test and the formula but before we go there so let's understand that this one is called um, a label and this one is formula so we have to uh, go through different paths or use different icon to put in label and formula okay now let's go to the design view now this is the design view and this is where we do any design of the layout of the report including putting in a label and the formulae okay now this is the report and this is the formula we have to put in and when we put in this label we have to come here look at here now this is called label when you look at and this one is called test box so this is label remember label and this one is text box so when you put in the label we have to use this one so you put in total report okay and and then if you want to use any color or any font you can come here like this okay highlight it and then you can come here to do put in any colors and any font or font size you want but the most important thing is remember this is a label a test is a label so you must put it in using the label icon okay and this part here is a formula and we must use this one the test box to enter formula so what we do is we hide we click here and then we got we activate the test box and then you put in here so when you see this orange you know that you are you have done the right thing so what you do now you put in the formula put in one formula so in here go to sum and you must put in the round bracket it tells SS to calculate and then you have to put in the square br bracket the spray of uh, the square bracket tells Excel where to get the source for calculation so both the round and square bracket are very important okay so this is it and how you put in the formula let's see the result go to the report view you just click OK here you will okay so it works although the layout is not that good 
so you know what you have to do to just change it and also did you notice that there is no decimal place and there's no uh, the currency symbol here and also the space between here and here is not accurate this is part of the process you cannot get everything done perfectly well just in one go so, so you can go back here go to design view and then you can come here just by moving highlight this one and you do the adjustment by moving them around and also in order to have the design view you should come here if you want to get the dollar sign or the currency symbol you highlight this one and then go to the property sheet and then you go to format then you use currency and then you can close so it will be done okay so this is the end of this recording